Dear friends, we are in our uh, year-long campaign on this theme of uh, protecting children from all forms of violence. And now let's look at the, the other aspect of uh, this subject, non-violence. Children learning non-violence. Children taking the path of non-violence in their own lives. Decades of social science research has shown that since violence is mostly learned behavior, non-violence can also be learned. Psychologists like Albert Pantura's early research revealed that children's aggressive acts were partly influenced by what they observed. In general, the more aggressive the people or the films children observe, the more aggressive children act. Learning by watching and imitating others rather than through one's own personal experience, this is called social learning. Uh, later research has shown that viewing violent acts on TV and in the movies affect people in ways more than one. It decreases the viewer's concern about the victim's suffering. It decreases the viewer's sensitivity towards others. It increases the likelihood that the viewers will emulate the aggressive acts depicted in the show or movie. And young children are very specially vulnerable to the effects of observed violence. Psychologists have recently applied these findings towards teaching non-violence to young children and their caregivers. Their research reveals that since violence is learned, non-violent ways of acting can also be learned. A question we must ask ourselves is, are we setting the right behavior examples for the young ones in our midst. Patience, kindness, honesty and humility are traits that we should seek to inculcate within every aspect of child's development so that they might form the fountain head where the kids draw from to conduct their lives. And we as adults with our varied experience in life are capable of molding new generation. With proper resources and training, parents, teachers and caretakers can make a significant impact upon how the children of the world perceive complex decision-making situations and grow in the spirit of non-violence.